सो टुडे आई विल बी शेयरिंग द जर्नी ऑफ पासिंग जी सी पी प्रोफेशनल डेटा इंजीनियर सर्टिफिकेशन सो जी सी पी प्रोफेशनल डेटा इंजीनियर सर्टिफिकेशन इज वन ऑफ द की सर्टिफिकेशन इन द इंडस्ट्री इफ यू आर वर्किंग इन ए जी सी पी प्लेटफॉर्म एंड यू आर ए जी सी पी डेटा इंजीनियर एज वेल सो वाइल प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर दिस सर्टिफिकेशन वट आई फेल्ट लाइक माई प्रोफेशनल एक्सपीरियंस वर्किंग ऑन वेरियस जी सी पी प्रोडक्ट it was very impactful and it kind of helped me in excelling the exam and building the intuition as well so i also posted uh, on linkedin about uh, some of the uh, preparation kit that one can refer while preparing for the uh, gcp uh, examination so first thing is the dance uh, sullivan gcp professional data engineer book along with the udemy course uh, he provide and the sample test is also there so this dan sullivan gcp pd book is one of the building block you can say like on top of this book you can have the overall go through of multiple gcp products like if you are uh, pretty much new or intermediate stage on your journey and you want to know about the product in an holistic way in in a uh, quick uh, span of time so you can have a overview of this book and that would really help and after that you can take this their sample test as well so then uh, if you are not much more uh, let's say uh, not hands on on the gcp product so for that you can use a cloud guru so a cloud guru a gcp course provide you the sample test and the sample uh, product environment where you can test out some of the gcp products and you can do some hands on with their labs so a cloud guru is also helpful if you want to do some hands on and recently like in the last year around november uh, gcp kind of changed their exam pattern and the overall syllabus so they included all these new products like analytics hub big lake dataplex data stream alloy db so it is very important to kind of go through all this uh, product let's say going through the gcp docs and the material that is available over the internet uh, to know about the use cases like when to use what and what are the challenges and when not to use them as well so these are pretty much helpful on kind of uh, having a broader overview like a cloud guru as well as uh, the dan sullivan book but let's say once you have the uh, little bit hands on and you are pretty much confident of taking the exam so before you take the exam it is very important to get familiarized with uh, the recent exam pattern that gcp has so it uh, for that like for familiarizing with the exam pattern and kind of do a practice session uh, on the realistic exam uh, like what can come in the real exam as well so for that gcp study hub is kind of i felt like one of the a very impactful website which provide you with the realistic question uh, that you can practice before taking the exam and that would really really help and uh, it also provides a kind of a money back guarantee if you don't uh, pass the exam and that really helps as well like to have the trust and to kind of try it uh, for for once yeah right so these these resources like if you can follow quickly and you kind of have some of the experience of working with a uh, gcp products then i feel it is very convenient uh, to kind of pass on the exam and uh, so uh, apart from that i feel like there should be a dedicated timeline around 300 to sorry uh, 330 to 40 hours of preparation so uh, dedicated preparation apart from the experience that you have so for going through the materials and the exam pattern so i feel like that is uh, pretty much needed and apart from that like uh, for the registering and all like you can register at any time if you are doing the remote proctored exam so for that the most requirement thing is like you have to maintain your overall setting up area like where you are giving the exam uh, in a secure environment you make you have to make the environment uh, um, like secure and there should not be any single thing on your desk and uh, uh, while taking the exam make sure you look on uh, on the screen and on the camera only not don't look anywhere else like that is uh, one of the main key things that people may forget 
and apart from that i feel after you take the exam and you get an immediate uh, notification you don't get any percentage like whether you got that many percentage or not you get a pass or fail remarks and if you get a pass remark so you can expect to get like most of the people get the certification by within two days only like i got myself uh, my certificate within two days and after that like you will also get to choose one of the perks from google uh, like the, their jacket t-shirts or mugs and other product as well as as the perks of passing the exam and i feel like they uh, this is one of the uh, like if you are working on gcp this is one of the exam that you can take and uh, google also kind of facilitate the remote proctored exam and rescheduling of examination and that also kind of helps to take the exam conveniently from anywhere else right so that is pretty much it uh, about this uh, professional data engineering examination journey and i feel if you are uh, dedicated in your preparation you can easily crack this exam and uh, uh you can kind of uh, build up on these things and take up the architect exam as well going forward so that's the uh, review from my side let me know if you have any doubt on this thank you